We've come to Arbroath, Scotland, where they've been investing with technology from ETG to bring their wire EDM work in-house. So Gordon, who are Northern Tool and Gear? Northern Tool and Gear is a family run gear company that's been on this site since 1945. We specialise in subcon gear, cut gear cutting and transmission part manufacture, small to medium batch with some high volume work as well. The capability of having wire in-house, what kind of operations does that allow you to do that previously you have other ways of doing them? Well, previously things like key weighing, we use a brooch, which is a high volume process, which you have another bay in the factory, or on an old fashioned slotting machine, which was slow, laborious, and had quality issues at times. Internal splines, external splines, external gears. We have dedicated machines to cut internal splines or external splines. They are fast and efficient, but they involve a lot of tooling and a lot of setup. Sometimes the tooling costs more than the job. So if somebody needs something in a hurry, if we can wire cut it, we can do it virtually immediately. Absolutely, this allows you to be flexible for flexible. those flexible. brand new prototypes. And these are quite exciting new designs. Yes, we get approached from major motorsport companies and they say we need you to manufacture these diff pinions or some diff pinions or diff gears for the start of the season to be changed from last year's design. If we're lucky, we have the tooling already if we're not, we have the source tooling. Sometimes it's the time it takes to procure the tool, tooling is more than the time we get to make the job. So going down the wire cutting uh, road allows us to do this and then possibly follow on with tooling afterwards for the higher volumes. But the initial prototypes or a small batch to get them up and running will be done in wire cutting. And this is one of the biggest machines I've seen on a wire EDM um, on a machine shop. What was the experience trying to pick this kind of machine from Mitsubishi Electric? Well, when we start, first started looking at wire, wire cutting, there are four or five major manufacturers there. I cut it down to two and eventually decided to go with, through a relationship with Ross at Ram and ETG, basically because they were the agents for Mitsubishi, which I'd been impressed with the machines from the start. And on visiting machines on site, I saw the quality of the product and the technology that's involved. Everything seems to be state of art, state of the art there and the control system etc. Very user friendly. And the backup I've had from Ross in the very beginning and Ross at Ram at the very beginning and ETG has been second to none. Uh, can't really fall it. Yeah and moving forward, so right now you're doing these kind of double keyways on a component but there's actually a lot more you can do just with the control in a, in a, in a gear manufacturing environment. Yes, uh, because of the technology in the, the Mitsubishi control system is very, very uh, powerful and user friendly. And basically anything we can program on that control system, we can wire on a part. And that gives some uh, immense tech, uh, flexibility when it comes to some of the changes in specification on splines, and gearing because they're always changing specifications and if you don't have this, the correct standard of cutter you can't use it it may be the right pitch it may be the right size but it doesn't have the correct profile on it it's a redundant cutter as far as that standard is concerned whereas if we can program it on the wire cutting machine it can be cut on that it's quite a slow process but it gives us a great deal of flexibility and the quality is exceptional